Hey guys, this is Matt here. I'm doing a Transformers review on Gem 1 Double Cross today. So I hope you enjoy it. This is going to be my first Transformer review. Uh, bear with me, I'm a little still new to this, so... Anyhow, let's get on to the review. I got him in the mail recently. And he's a very cool Generation 1 Autobot. Uh, a part of the Three Team Robot Monster Box. And this is original vintage Transformer here. As you can see, he's a dragon, his alternate mode. Love his wings. He's a two headed dragon, much like Hunger or Hungar. Uh, and he is <coughs> a very peculiar looking Autobot, I have to say. Uh, <coughs> but I like him. He has a certain appeal, and a lot of individuals. I actually like the Monster Bots a lot. Uh, I have two of them. I don't have Rapungus, but <clears throat> hopefully I will one day. Let's get into transformation. Now, as you can see, because of his necks here on his dragon mode, this fellow is very articulated. This one's not in the best of condition, it's kind of beat up. Well, to transform him, what you're going to want to do first. There's a split in his tail right here. I'm just going to open that up. Push his legs in. Turn these upwards. Spin around this way. Pull his wings out. Let me do that one more time. Wings were like that. I'm going to pull them out that way. Arms go down, head flips up, and you can position his wings either out in robot mode, put him up like this. Now because of his transformation, he's very articulated, and I kind of like that. I mean, for a Gen 1 he is. Pretty cool looking bot though, I love his face sculpt. Got a nice little expression there. Looks very pleased with himself. I don't know how well my camera's picking it up. Now I don't have his guns. He has two guns that come with him. And <clears throat> I really like to have those, but normally they fit in this 5mm port right here. Doesn't have the best stickers, but there is a new repro label right here, so I appreciate that. <laughs> but yeah, he uh it's pretty cool. I definitely recommend him to anyone who doesn't have him and is collecting Generation 1. Are just very interesting, fun Transformers. And that's what this guy is. Very fun. Uh, he's not going to present the most challenging transformation, as you can see, but he's definitely something worth picking up. He's going to run about uh, 25 30 bucks loose without any uh, without his guns. Probably around 50 if he had, if he was complete. Uh, <clears throat> If he was boxed, expect to pay a, a good bit more. Uh, <clears throat> but, yeah, pick him up. Thank you for watching, and I hope that you, you've enjoyed it. I'm going to have some more reviews up. Uh, just uh, let me know what you think in the comments section. Thanks, guys.